What's going on guys? I had no idea I was going to be putting out a video today. I was pleasantly surprised uh, when I went outside my doorstep today and found this bad boy right here from 5k toys. Totally wasn't expecting it today, but here it is the 5k toys party wagon. So for those of you who didn't know, uh, this was a special pre-order that came out a couple months ago. Uh, this one here was about $256. I'm sure you're all familiar with the Super 7 one that was uh, $500 and now NECA also announced they have a party wagon coming out for a, right around the same price as this one, maybe a little bit more. But I made my decision. Let's see if I'm going to be happy with it. Hey guys, before the uh, official unveiling, pulling it out of the box and all that stuff, hey, can you guys do me a favor? Uh, I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit that bell, uh, so you guys can get notified next time I drop a YouTube video. I'd really appreciate it. Now let's go ahead and pull this thing out and check it out. All right, guys, got it out, and uh, apparently I got some assembling to do here. Got to install the uh, turtle letters here on the front, and uh, I got to install the rear spoiler. So let's go ahead and get her done. All right, got the pieces out here, got the spoiler, the two sides, got some letters here. So uh, let's get her knocked out. Ooh, man, this thing is going to be sweet. Super stoked. All right, guys, got these little side posts here. Push them right on in the side. They're a little firm, but the, once they're in, they're in. Nice snug fit. Here it is, guys. Got the letters on there. Got the wing on there. Oh, man. This thing is incredible. The size of this thing is ridiculous. Well, first impressions are everything, and uh, this thing has definitely made an impression on me. This thing looks exactly like the cartoon exactly like the turtle van that i wanted uh, as a kid just look at those teeth that ain't no sticker guys that's molded boy that looks amazing don't get me wrong i love the original turtle van but after watching so many years of the cartoon you know you just kind of want one that opens from the top like this it's got these cannons that look just like the cartoon look at that range of motion on these things but I think I'll have it just about there. That's the way that I think she should be. Let's check out this antenna. Is this thing? Nope, nope, no movement on there. No movement on the mirrors. Let's go ahead and open this thing up. Man, I cannot wait to get into this thing. How cool is this top? I know you all remember them popping out of this thing in the intro. Just amazing. It's got one. Uh, side door ramp over here that opens up don't worry I'll go ahead and open that up all the way uh, but let's open up this side it's got a little door on here and there is the cannon boy let's get that thing out here check her out look at that man look at this ingenuity here holy moly how cool is this thing folds up real nice and it looks great now, I will admit, not a super amount of detail uh, on the Canon, but again, the price is right. 250 bucks, I mean, I I'm not going to complain about it. it. It still looks pretty, pretty dang cool. All right, let's go ahead and move it to the back of the bus. Open up these rear doors. Look at that range of motion. So smooth, too. All the way open. Wow. And let's go ahead and get that interior shot I know you're all waiting for. Man, uh, I know I was hitting on the detail a little bit, but I will take this all day long. This looks so cool. Got the supercomputer radar dealies back here. We got some steps. We got the gun, some screens. I'm sure you could print off a little couple stickers that would fit those screens to give it a little bit more detail if you want. Yeah, that's one thing, man. Can you imagine some of the customs on this thing? Man, that's going to look crazy cool. All right, moving up back to the front of the bus. Let's fold this gun in here and see if this, get this door open here. Oh, yeah. Got some green detail here on the armrest. We got a dashboard with the steering wheel got the 
the old turn signal definitely got some detail up in the dashboard there got a little shifter here let's see if this thing moves oh and it does that's pretty cool shifter down shifter up all right that is pretty dang cool all right let's spin this thing around we'll get the ramp uh fully down here okay let's get this door open and check out the driver's side here here's the mirrors or sort of mirror silver at least yep got a little uh turn signal no movement there on the steering wheel not a big deal got some gauges it's even got some pedals down there that's pretty sweet all right let's check out the back here man all right so that's what it looks like with it folded in like that the little cannon deal we got some fire extinguishers here no movement there just wow guys this thing is crazy cool i absolutely love this thing so happy i got this thing I don't know how many they made or if they're going to do a second run of these things, but uh, some people are going to be mad they missed out on this guy. And underneath the roof here, it looks like we've got some weapon racks. So that is handy. And one thing, guys, I had no idea that this thing was going to have. Working headlights. Are you kidding me? This thing is so sick. Yeah, like I said, I had no idea that it even did that, but what a surprise. What a surprise. Absolutely blown away. That is so cool. I mean, it makes sense, but I just, I didn't know. But let's go ahead and get that comparison going here. We got the original party wagon, turtle van, whatever you want to call it. Just look at this size comparison both extremely cool vehicles no doubt but this guy right here in the back this goliath boy holy moly and yes i understand that this one is based off the cartoon and not the toy line but it's the only thing i really got for a comparison so we're gonna compare it this 5k toys turtle van is just towering over this original one but let's go ahead and get some measurements on this 5k toys turtle van all right, we're at, what do we got? Okay, we got lined up. So it looks like it's about 16 and a half, uh, 16 and a half, 17 inches, something like that. All right, and from the bottom, we're at about one foot tall. And let's go ahead and get the width here. We are looking at just about uh, 11 inches so holy smokes yeah it's uh it's pretty big all right let's go ahead and bring in the original 1988 playmates toy figures and see how they size up here and as expected uh, they come in about half the size of the van looking a little small for this thing but I figured you guys would probably want to see them in this thing and see for yourself. That one doesn't look too bad there. And there he is on the cannon. So not too shabby, just looks a little bit small behind the wheel. So, so the Playmates version was just a little bit small. Let's go ahead and move on to the Super 7 Ultimates and see how they look. This one looks a little bit better here. And let's go ahead and put him behind the wheel and see what that looks like. Okay, looks okay there. Looking pretty fresh, pretty solid there. All right, let's put him in front of the instrumentations. Honestly, looks looks a little bit big uh, for it, but I think, I think it could work. Let's go ahead and put Raph where he belongs, right here on the popping out side door action cannon. All right, he looks pretty dang good on there obviously looks great on the cannon but let's go ahead and do our last comparison the NECA version of the turtles so the original 1988 versions were a little bit small the super 7 ultimates were a little bit big so let's go ahead and get that perfect fit and go ahead and go with the NECA turtle versions and see how they look and honestly they look pretty dang good uh, I have kind of been off the NECA bandwagon a little bit lately 
but in this situation these things look real real nice in this party wagon let's go ahead and throw them in the back oh yep yeah, again they look pretty dang cool he's at the right angle the right height he looks great in here absolutely fantastic let's go ahead and throw him on the gun and see about that again looks just about right i think these figures here are definitely the ones that you want to use uh, if you have the 5k party wagon for sure but yeah guys i think that's going to do it for my review of the 5k toys party wagon uh, i made my choice and i am very happy with it which one did you guys pick up and which one or which one do you guys think looks the best the 5k version the NECA version or the super 7 version um, leave it down in the comments below and let me know thanks for watching the video guys and if you guys liked it please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell later